We're back on the North Coast Trail in the Botanic Gardens. Uh, what we have off to my right here is really one of my favorite California natives. This is a western red, red bud, Circus occidentalis. Uh, well, certainly now the main feature of this plant is these beautiful magenta flowers. Um, and when this is in full bloom, it's a, it's a tree that you can see from uh, 100 yards away. Uh, but this is really a tree or large shrub that has interest all throughout the year. Um, after uh, uh, it's finished blooming, or actually while it's blooming, the leaves start to emerge. And you can see a few of them on here. And um, the leaves are a different shape than most of the California natives. They're uh, round with a lot, oftentimes with a, a notch at the end. Um, Oftentimes, the, uh, as these leaves mature, they take on kind of a bluish green color. Uh, so those leaves are pretty in themselves. Um, another thing you'll find sometimes is uh, you'll see these uh, circular holes cut in the leaves. The uh, Western Redbud seems to be one of the uh, favorite sources of nesting material for leaf cutter bees. Um, in the fall, oftentimes the uh, Western Redbud will get some fall color. Uh, you'll see the leaves turn yellow. And then even uh, in winter, uh, because this is a winter deciduous shrub, uh, when it loses its leaves, even the shape of the twigs have kind of a, a zigzag pattern to them. So even when uh, Western Redbud is out of leaf, it, it still looks beautiful. So for four season interest, uh, this is a wonderful and probably greatly underutilized tree uh, to plant.